video so I know it's been a little quiet for me but school life work happened but we are here now and it's finals week it's busy it's stressful so if you're at Queens or you're thinking of coming to Queens University in this video I'll be sharing a bunch of study spots that are not only close to campus they're within walking distance, they have the heart, and it's very realistic for students. So I totally didn't make this video for the sole purpose being that I haven't explored many places on campus. So in today's video, I'll be going to different study spots, rating them, and then also asking other students to share their opinions as well. So let's go. So our first spot is the Biosciences Complex. Can you guess why? Think winter time and natural sunlight. Like, wow, look at how good that looks. I wanted to come here first because it was 3 o'clock when we started filming and the sun goes down at 4 in the winter time. So if I came any later, forget about this view, you wouldn't see it. It's so quiet here, I'm afraid to speak, like no one's talking. Here I met up with Tara, my YouTube partner in crime, so make sure to subscribe to her channel as well. We did a little bit of exploring because this is my first time here and we found some very cool chairs as you can see here and a walrus. So on a scale of 1 to 10, what would you rate studying here? Good 7 or 8. Yep, I'd say that too. Okay, okay. good 7 or 8. I don't think people realize how quiet it actually can be in here sometimes. Okay. Like people always go for the library first but sometimes it's harder to find a seat there than where you can just come in there and sit. I said that. I was like, it's my first time here today to study. Me too. Right? Okay, and I'm like, it's so quiet. It's so much better because I won't spend 20 minutes trying to find a seat at Stauffer. And I like the natural yes. sunlight. Yes. It's like oh sad God, guys. The it's the like trees. the nature. Speaking of studying, when I study, I like to wear clothing that not only looks good, but I also feel confident in. And studies have found that there's science behind how you dress. It improves your motivation and your productivity. And obviously, you still want to be comfy, but some of my must-haves when you're trying to grind things out are jewelry from Ana Luisa, such as the necklace that has my initial on it, the earrings, as well as this matching bracelet. They're so light and dainty, and I already have a couple of pieces from them. They're all part of my capsule wardrobe, and it's such an easy way to boost your productivity and increase your positive energy. Right now, they have a holiday sale where you can buy one and get another one at 50% off. There's also a flash sale for 50% off gift sets and a free gift box with a bundle. This is way too good, so feel free to check out the description box for more information on that. don't say dress for success for nothing so even when you're studying show up and so you also don't know who you're gonna see but let's get back into the next study spot next up douglas library you'll notice the next few spots are very close in distance and that's because i wanted to choose ones that were accessible for all students we are now headed towards one of the most popular spots in this library if you're a Harry Potter fan, this place should look familiar. Everyone here, we call it the Harry Potter room. And here's some other study spots. Well, look, look at that note. Let's see what's on there. Oh, so cute. I was genuinely surprised. We have a coloring station because your mental state matters. Next up, stop the library. Look at that sunlight, that view. So Stauffer and Douglas are very close together. There's goods and right beside is the law building. We're going to Stauffer now, yay! 
Stoffel is one of the busiest libraries. Like, you'll literally see everyone. Everyone you hate, everyone you like, they will be here. I used to come here all the time in first year. And normally during the exam season, you literally cannot find a spot. Like, it's difficult. It's hard. This is the fireplace reading room. Look, very cute. You will see. our next interviewee hopefully she is okay with us asking her questions she looks very focused how would you rate this study squad um probably like an eight she's a little bit loud hmm. and is there something about this place that other people don't know or you think is not appreciated enough um not really i personally like places with comfy chairs but like everyone has like the first study squat and my friends like upstairs was in like quieter. Mm -hmm. I don't mind the noise because I have like airpods and stuff. But I don't think anything. A lot of people are always here. It's really hard to find spots. I think it's pretty appreciated. Next up, the law building. another coding station. I love it. On a scale of 1 to 10, how would you rate studying here? I rated a solid 6. Um, I wanted a Kobo girl first, but oh, okay. just, you know, it's a nice to mix it up. Uh -huh. the location in. I think it's the location away from Stop because Stop is considered such a hub and kind of mm -hmm. the main place where okay. people go. It's a nice section of the um, altogether quiet, fairly central, but saving the best for last we're ending our trip at goods hall okay i'm going to be very biased because this is where i spend 99 percent of my time and all of my classes are here i used to go to Stafford to study but now that i've studied at goods there is no going back There's so many places to study, such as those round chairs on the upper level. There's also the lecture halls. And Goods Commons, where you can always find someone to talk to. And Starbucks. This is Goods from another angle, because why not? It was now 5 or 6 o'clock, and we're exhausted from walking in the cold. So we're taking a quick break, and Tara's watching soccer. Tara, you should show show them what you're watching. No, it's not loading. Oh, okay, Messi. Okay, so Messi scored. Apparently, it should be. Okay, Messi scored. I missed the goal though. You gotta go back. Oh, I can't go back. The Comsock Student Lounge is my new study spot. They didn't open it last year because of COVID, but now that it's open, this is the reason I stay at Goods. This is why. Ten out of ten because they have free snacks. I'll give it an eight. <laughs> mm, solid ten out of ten. Okay. Anything that you think people don't know or is not appreciated enough about this place? Um, I think the Goods Cafe is a new find that I've been really loving recently. I highly recommend. Also, the lack of crowding. Like you go to stop and there's just too many oh, people there. A lot of people have been saying stop as a as like a no no. Yeah, it's been bad. Yeah, probably agree about the like the lack of crowding that's why we came here and now we can come back <laughs> <Okay. laughs> we're now in one of the lecture rooms Yay. what's your favorite study spot on campus um i think my favorite study spot would be mccory in those little booths because you would get your little private booths and it's very quiet to study there and they just also, if you get like markers, you can write on the glass, which is very helpful. You need to draw graphs and everything. I just love it there. Recommend. You have one motivational message or quote for all of those studying the finals right now. You got this. <laughs> Don't get too hard on yourself. 
try your best, and if you tried your best, you shouldn't be upset with the end result. Do it. Just do it. You got this. Um, good luck, I guess. We're almost there. It's going to be okay. I would say keep up the hard work. Almost at the end of the grind. So that's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you go to Queens, maybe now you're a little bit more familiar with some of the popular campus study spots and feel free to let me know in the comments where you like to study and if I missed any. Remember that right now Anna Luisa is having the holiday sale where you can buy one get one 50% off so you don't want to miss that. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!